Today on News Bites, whites need not apply. Fauci, the CIA, and COVID. And why was Philly looted? Stick around for these bites and more, all on today's News Bites. Okay, real fast, the central infrastructure of the Volkswagen Group was paralyzed by an IT malfunction. Production at several plants in Germany are at a standstill, a company spokesperson said. This comes as yesterday, VW announced it would cut EV production due to shrinking demand. All right, here's the scoop. A Bloomberg study found that in 88 S&P 100 companies, that 94% of new jobs in 2021 were filled by, quote, people of color or non-whites, increasing their U.S. workforce by over 323,000 in 21 with 94% of the jobs going to blacks, Hispanics, and Asians, and only 6% going to whites, with an increase in, quote, racial diversity among executives and managers compared to 2020. 74% of executive positions were held by white people in 21. The trend of increasing non-white hiring began when many large corporations pledged to address, quote, racial imbalances in their workforce following the 2020 BLM riots. Okay, check this out. Large mobs looted multiple stores and damaged property across Center City, Philadelphia last night. The was in response to a judge dismissing all charges against a cop who shot and killed Puerto Rican Eddie Irizarry during a traffic stop for erratic driving. The cops said Eddie lunged at them with a weapon from outside the car, but body cam footage showed him inside the car. However, Eddie was in possession of a knife during the incident, which the defense argued its handle looked like a gun's grip. Watch. Okay, here's the latest. The House Select Subcommittee on COVID's Origins, Chairman Brad Wenstrup, revealed new information about Dr. Fauci's involvement with the CIA's Origins investigation. New information suggests Fauci went to CIA headquarters, was let in without record to, quote, influence their review of COVID. Evidence also shows Fauci prompted the drafting of a paper attempting to disprove the lab leak theory. This follows reports the CIA analysts received financial bribes to conclude the origins were inconclusive and likely from bats not the Wuhan lab. Wenstrup seeks all documents on Fauci's access to CIA facilities and employees with mounting evidence implicating federal officials in covering up COVID's origins. All right, check this one out. Iran's IRGC today launched their third military satellite, NOR-3, which means light in Persian, into low space orbit. Iranian officials promise to carry on with the expanding satellite program and are expected to launch several more satellites into different orbits. Take a look. Okay, Costa Rica's President Chavez will declare a state of emergency amid a large migrant influx. Over 386,000 migrants have passed through Costa Rica from Panama since January. 60,000 entered just this month through a town of 20,000 on the Panama border and in recent days causing unrest and riots. Further destabilization will push migrants further north to the U.S. and Mexico. Migrants are from Central America, but also Venezuela, Haiti, Cuba, Africa, and Asia. Chavez orders the security ministry takes a firm stance saying, quote, Kindness can't be taken for weakness, adding that Costa Rica is reaching a breaking point. Those are today's bites, which are on our website at disclose.tv. Subscribe and leave your comments below.